All right, everybody, Sarasota Tim coming to you from Costa Maya, Mexico. The port here uh, is the last port of call on our seven day cruise in the Western Caribbean on Wonder of the Seas. There's the cruise ship right back behind us. We just got over here onto the port. It's a new port uh, with lots of new uh, stores and shops that we haven't seen before. So let's take you around now and show you what you can expect when you come off the ship. Uh, no matter what ship you come here on, you got a long walk down the pier. I think they do have a trolley car, but it doesn't seem to be working. So let's take a walk because everything I see over here is new. So uh, let's take a walk together and see what we got. Naturally, there's always places to grab a drink. There's some uh, authentic Mexican people here with their whole get-ups. Some dancers are gonna be getting up here to entertain you, or actually for photos. <laughs> Headhunters, port entrance. All right, we gotta avoid that music back here. Ed Sharan was playing. Oh, here we go. Hopefully there's no music in here. Because of the uh, climate that we're in, we're hopefully in some air conditioning. Nationally, they like to sell you these uh, Mexican liqueurs, the uh, port uh, tax duty free and all that. You can get your uh, Kahlua and other things. Uh, so let's move on down here. And here's your Rolex watch. You want a Rolex? So this is what the shops look like as you come through here. You've heard me mention about a, uh, I call it the swing set because before any of this was built, uh, some of this looks kind of old, so it may have been here, this, this perimeter here. They've always had something, but there's a lot of new stuff towards over here that is definitely um, new. So this is the uh, swing set, and those are the guys that will go up and climb up this pole. Yeah, this whole building is new because we used to stand here unobstructed. There was a big crowd standing right here, and then these guys would go up and, uh, they wrap themselves in something. They sit up there and they kind of just unwrap themselves as they roll down. We'll catch it later. We're gonna do it again. But yeah, these were built. This is this is new stuff. You can tell those are new. And we'll keep on going. This is Cafe Mexico. Then I had a great cup of coffee this morning. I think it was the best cup of coffee I've ever drank in my life. I was in the uh, solarium and I got my breakfast and I was sitting at the table and they wait on you hand and foot there. They're just so amazing uh, how you're treated on a cruise. It really is crazy. And uh, the nice gentleman come over and asked me if I wanted something to drink. And so I um, actually uh, said, yeah, I'll take a cup of coffee. He goes, with cream? And he brought it back with cream already in it. It was the best cup of coffee I ever drank in my life. So here's some cowboy boots for you. Cowboy Tim, if he would have took the cruise, he might have took a look over there. Oh yeah, we got a lot of new shops, folks. This is, look, this is all new. And this is actually very inviting. This is very nice. Gonna go in there? All right, I'll be right back. All right, T's already found her a place to go shopping. As I walk around and show you guys, give you the tour here. Uh, this is definitely an improvement, wow. All of this is nice. And I'm telling you, this is the last port of our cruise. Believe it or not, this port is before Roatan, and the ship went right past this, straight, straight to Roatan uh, from Cozumel. And then cruised very slowly last night, all the way back. Oh, we're gonna have to cut the music on this clip. Look at this, look at what they've got here now. All right, we're gonna be having to mute this clip. Look at this, oh my gosh, wow. This is nice, folks. This is like Coke OK. I might have to eat my words and book another cruise to come back here. This looks pretty nice. Look how big it is, it goes all the way around over there. Oh yeah, we'll be having to cut the music on that clip. This clip will be completely muted.
All right, let's keep on going. Oh, there's a little walkway here. It goes over the pool. It's like Swiss Family Robinson here, folks. Another bar in here. How you doing, boss? Check out the uh, shops here. How are you doing, my friend? Doing good. Welcome to YouTube. Well, thank you. Welcome to the jungle. <laughs> Check it out, beautiful stores, shops. Come and see this guy right here for all your jewelry. Beautiful shop. My friend Cowboy Tim, he should have came. Oh, here's some nice shirts. Oh, they're well organized and a great looking selection too, by the way. These are very colorful, very nice looking stuff. Oh, get your hair done, your nails done. We can do it for you. Oh, what I drop? Ha 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 Got a good one. That's a good one. You got me. You drop something, you smile. They do anything to kind of get you, you know? Get you to listen to them. Man, there's a lot of shopping to be done here. You can spend... Now listen to this, folks. Because we have such a long way to go back to Port Canaveral. What a tease this is. You know what time we got here? Off the ship at 7.30 and back on the ship at 1.30 today. This is no four or five o'clock. Oh, it goes back over there, more, more shops back there. Oh my gosh, they have really, how are you gonna do it all by 1.30? Welcome to YouTube. Here we are uh, walking around in the, oh, the pool area continues over here. Folks, I'm telling you the first time in my life I've ever seen any of this on Costa Maya. Man, am I glad we got off the ship. We, tw twice we've been here and did not get off. Look at this big bar here, this is great. Twice we've been here and didn't get off because there was nothing here. Just the swing set. Look at all these tables and chairs. Look at this place. This is insane. There's another little walkway. There's the Wander of the Seas in the background there. Oh my gosh. What is this, swim with the dolphins or something? It is, look, there's dolphins in there. Oh my goodness, folks. Oh, isn't that cute? Look at that, folks. <laughs> wow. All right, folks, we're uh, back here. I was just trying to text a family member to see if they wanted to FaceTime and see the dolphins. I don't know what the admission is for this ride, but isn't that cool? Someone's in the water there uh, helping out. There's one over there, gonna give this lady a ride. Waiting to push her. Look at that. <laughs> that dolphin can really push. Well, that's even entertaining for me. I haven't seen a dolphin in a long time. There's one way back there, uh, entertaining people. Well, it just never ends here in Costa Maya. Look at the flamingos that we've got. How amazing, look at that. These things are huge and beautiful. Wow. Look at all of them. They go back there too. I've never seen one actually so close. This is great. Look at them. I told you folks, we're literally in a uh, jungle here in this part of Mexico. So indigenous animals like these are probably everywhere. And they've got it made. I guess you can take a walk through. I don't know if there's a charge for it, but you can go all around. There's a, um, 
elevated um, platform that goes all around the, uh, the port here. And just checking this out. How cool. Amazing swimming pool, dolphins, uh, the um, flamingos back over there, the mall, the shopping, the stores are all the way around, one after the other. Everybody is off the ship today here. The pool is amazing. It just goes all around everywhere. Bars, restaurants, there's the big ship out there. It's really cool looking. This is better than a Coco Cay because you've got the pool, you got all these bars that go back and forth on both sides. I do like it better than Coco Cay. I really do. This is special. And you only have to walk a mile <laughs> from the ship down that pier uh, to get here, but it's worth it. Now, the only thing that I will say is uh, this is not Royal Caribbean and owned. This is uh, the locals here. Uh, Royal Caribbean might have their hand in it, I don't know, but uh, plenty of people here are absolutely uh, going to be asking you to come in their stores. There's not going to be any shortage of, uh, of solicitation, that is for sure. But you just kindly smile and thank you or just keep walking. Um, some can be a little persistent, but that's just how it is. They're hungry and aggressive uh, to make some money. Right now it's $1 for 16 pesos and everything is written in both pesos and dollars here so as we pass on through here you can see this is just everybody's off the ship now because it's back on the ship by 1 30 it's 10 30 now this is what they do right here <laughs> ma'am <laughs> I had one guy tell me, he goes, you dropped something. And he got me, he says, you dropped something. And I just kept walking. And I, he finally, I finally, you hear him back there? He's, he's following me. He says, you dropped something. And I finally, I bit and I said, I looked back. He says, your smile. So, I mean, they got all kinds of cliches and things that they say to, uh, to draw you in. See, they're all standing there. Come on in, come on in. Take a look, take a look. Just like going down in the Keys, actually. They do the same thing at the t-shirt shops on Duval Street. They do the same thing in St. Thomas on the Diamond District. So it's just part of it. Don't let it worry you. They're harmless and they're just doing their job. And it actually works for them because if they stood there like a bump on a log, you know, people would just, some, pe some people would go in, but others might just walk away. Now we're gonna show you the, uh, the uh, thing that they've done since the beginning of time here. Get out of the sunlight. I think they're going to start spinning. <laughs> They've done the show already several times. Uh, for the tourists here. They are ready now. All right. So please let's give them a big round of applause to support and motivate the flyers. There they go. Originally, Seeing it first. The flyers outfit were Getting lower and lower. You can see where it unwinds right up there.
Getting lower, watch your head. There you go, folks. They definitely crushed it.